Hello and welcome to another tutorial of CSS and HTML. As you're looking at this code, let me explain this code to you. What I want to achieve here is I have two images and I want to overlap one image with another image and they are, these are the two images of the people. So in CSS we have a special property called Z index that allows you to layer things. So the higher the number, the top the layer it would be. So I have one static layer, which is my person one. I have not given it any Z index. And I have one absolute layer. So let me explain that to you. There is a property in CSS called position, which could have a value of relative or absolute. So right now I'm using an absolute value that means it should start from a corner of a page and should be absolutely displaced by 140 pixels from the left of the page and 120 pixels from the top of the page. If I use a position relative, that would mean wherever the image is relative to that position, displace it by 140 pixels by 120 pixels. So over here, I've used a z-index property of one, position of absolute so that my image could float around freely on the page. I've displaced this 140 pixels from the left and 120 pixels from the top. And I have two images, person one and person two, and I'm layering my person two to appear on top of the person one. So when I run it in the browser, here you can see that how one image is basically being overlapped by the other image. So this is my first image and the second image of this woman is overlapping this guy's image. So this is how I have moved it 120 pixels um, from the left and uh, 140 pixels from the left and 120 pixels from the top and then I've made them overlap each other. So that's what Z index property can do and position absolute can do. So we're gonna explore the position absolute along with some of the other um, things in the CSS in the next tutorial. Hope you have enjoyed this short tutorial. Thank you for watching.